everybody, it's Amber again, and I have another Christmas project to share with you. This is another craft fair idea, and this one was actually created by my sister Bree, who you all know. Um, she's created a couple of other projects here on my channel for this craft fair series. So let me go ahead and get into this. What I used is this wonderful, amazing tool again, and you guys have seen this in my other tag video. I love this thing. It's a Stampin' Up! Tag Punch, and there are different variations I've heard because that one's, I guess, um, retired. But my friend Patty sent that to me, so thank you, Patty. So here are the adorable Christmas tags that my sister Bree made. So for this, you guys, it's another dollar item, and I love having dollar items at my craft booth, just like the note cards and envelopes that I made in my very first Craft Fair Series video of this year. Those were dollar items, and these four tags are also dollar items. So what she did is she got really, really pretty Christmas paper, all her paper pads out, and she cut them down to four and a half by two and a half, used the um, to and from stamps. So there's the to and the from, and I believe she got these on clearance at Hobby Lobby. And she just used some stays on ink so it didn't smear. And then, of course, took that wonderful tag punch and just punched the top and did the trick that I came up with with the washi that um, so all the tags will be displayed. And then she put some sparkly, um, really skinny Christmas ribbon and just a slip knot through the top. And she packaged it up in one of these, of course, clear bags with the adhesive on the top for a nice little package. I apologize for any background noise, you guys. I'm out here hanging out with my husband, and he's watching football and eating snacks over there so if you hear that that's just him um, but anyways I wanted to share these with you guys and it's so simple I'm not even gonna do a tutorial because you know as you know I have a tutorial for tags already in this craft fair series and I'm gonna go ahead and link all my craft fair series videos below so you can see and I'll be sure to link that tag video on the top I just really love how these came out and I love how she's packaged them all up and they just look so cute. And who doesn't want four handmade Christmas tags with the to and from already on there and just a nice handmade item for $1 at the craft fair. So I'm going to go ahead and show you all the ones she made, you guys. She made so many. And I really love them. But before I show you, I'm going to go ahead and show you the clear bags that she used for these. Um, you can use any size you have as long as they fit the tag you're making. But if you're interested, here's the style or the item number for the ones that she used. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and show you all the tags that she made. tag packs that she made I think she made just around 40 and I think that they're just so beautifully displayed and such a great um, little one dollar grab at the craft fair so she might make some more of these because they're so fun you know who doesn't love cutting paper and stringing ribbon so she might end up making some more but I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the three paper pads that she used to create these beautiful tags because I just love how she combined all these patterns and designs. I just think it's so pretty. So I'm going to show you the paper pads that she used to create these. Okay, so the first paper pad is this Mombi, and it's called Merry Christmas, I think. Um, but it's this Christmas pad by Mombi, and it's these pa um, tags here with the stripes. And the second paper pad is from Hobby Lobby, and it's the brighter color kind of non-traditional Christmas ones and I think those are so gorgeous and then the last one is this bow bunny paper pad and um, she used those to make kind of more the vintage and classic looking ones so those are the three paper pads she used you guys oh you know what she actually used a fourth one she used this Pine Street Square I think it's called from Hobby Lobby and she used that and kind of incorporated some tags 
I'll show you right here, like the Santa Claus. And just they're like more distressed and vintage looking. And she just kind of combined those with the other ones. So those are the four paper pads she used to create these. Thank you all so much for watching. And Brie thanks you as well. I'm going to be linking the tutorial to make these tags in the description box below along with all of my other craft fair series videos. And as mentioned throughout this video, Brie is going to be charging $1 per pack for these tags. And um, I think that's a great price and I think they're going to sell out. So thanks again so much for watching. Subscribe please if you haven't already because there's going to be lots more Christmas videos um, for craft fair ideas this week. Thanks again everyone. Bye. Thank you.